Hi, in this video, I'll show you how to create a GIT repository for an Eclipse project. So, first we need to understand that in Eclipse, there are two ways that you can create the project. First is where uh, you create the project folder within the workspace. Uh, this is the default way how Eclipse work, but uh, you can choose to keep the project folder outside the Eclipse workspace somewhere else on your machine. Uh, we'll head on to Eclipse and we'll go through both the scenarios. So first we'll create a project. We'll name it example 001. So here you can see that the project is the folder is within the workspace. So we'll keep it that way and we'll click finish. Uh, now the project is created. Uh, so now we'll create the GIT repository. Uh, first we'll check that the project is here. Yeah, this is the project folder. So right now there is no GIT folder here. So we'll right click in Eclipse uh, on the project and on team there are two options so here you will see share project you have to click on that select GIT then you have to check this box which says use or create repository in parent folder of project and you have to select the project and now you see a warning over here which says creation of repositories in the Eclipse workspace is not recommended. So because the project folder is within the workspace that's why you see this warning. Uh, we will continue for now. We'll, uh, you have to click on repository, create repository uh, to create the repository within this folder. And then click on finish. Uh, now your project has a GIT repository. Uh, we can verify it over here, example 001, uh, this is the GIT folder and you can commit the first version, uh, first you need to add the files to index and then team commit, uh, initial commit, so uh, we'll commit that. So now you can do whatever you want with this GIT repository. All the options for GIT is under team. So now we'll see the second scenario where we keep the project folder outside of Eclipse, uh, outside of the Eclipse workspace uh, in this folder. In the projects folder, we'll keep that new project. So we'll create another project. I will keep the name as example 002. Instead of uh, going by this default option, uh, we'll uncheck this and we'll have to browse. So we'll browse and select the folder where you want the project to be created. So here we'll create a folder called example 002. So now you can see that the, this new project will be created outside of the workspace in this projects folder example 002. Click finish. So now we'll verify that. So first project was here in the workspace. So the next project we have created outside of the workspace. Right now there is no GIT over here, so we'll create a repository. So for that, we'll right click on the second project and we'll select team share project, select GIT and here again we'll select use or create repository in parent folder of project and we'll select the project. So right now you see that there is no warning like before. So just cl uh, click create repository 
and click on finish now you'll see that the GIT folder dot GIT folder is created over here which says that the project is right now under GIT versioning so now we can add these files to index and commit so same way like before all the options for GIT is under team uh, on the right click uh, when you right click on the project you can get all get to all these options so that's how you create a GIT repository for uh, Eclipse project uh, hope you like this video uh, I have more such videos on my youtube channel please have a look If you like my videos, please subscribe, like and share. If you have any questions, please post in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.